no it feels good but i did not obviously in 2012 i did not know what the journey would be because i thought uh, well for me the story was the bristol bus boycott to be honest i heard about it i learned about it i met paul stevenson and i was super excited about it because for me that was that was sort of the proof that there's actually a European version of the civil rights movement that was going on in the US. And at that time, I think Black Power Mixtape came, came out. I don't know if some of you have seen it. Um, so I got super excited about it. And uh, that was actually the moment where Rob said, okay, look, this is all nice, um, but we need to sort of put it into today's time and update the story. So at that point, terms of how I feel about it. I, at that point, I didn't know that this story, this journey would take up so long because I thought Marvin was going to win first round. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't have made such a good movie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No, so, I mean, now, obviously, it's been, um, it's been a long time. We've been, we had our struggle, Marvin had his struggle, um, and at many times, we weren't really sure if we were going to finish the film. Um, because there were lots of obstacles, money-wise, mainly. Um, so thanks again to those of us. And many of you in this room have supported that as well, just yeah, talk about yeah, money-wise. Yeah. Thank you very much. So to actually feel, to actually watch the result now with you guys together, no, it's, it's uh, overwhelming, it's great. Okay, so I'm going to come to the... Uh,